y'all hustlers, how y'all doing today? Come on in for this movie today. Y'all ready? Okay, let's see. Okay. The production is Icy Noodles. Mm-hmm. Had to come back. And the director is Leftover uh, Pork Roast. Mm-hmm. You know. And uh, we have a little dressing back here because we have some other stuff that came for a surprise. So look here, y'all. This is the beginning of August, a new season. Mm -hmm. Y'all ready for it? New beginnings. This is what the movie gonna be about, okay? This is scene four, take two. Let's roll the tape. Come on in. Bring your Kool-Aid, your cocktail, your water. Bring your food and snacks. Let's sit and chat with this one hood girl to the hood. Uh, let's say prayers and then we're going to toast with this water. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell y'all some stories that leave, if I can remember. Okay. <laughs> let's bow heads. Father God, I just want to say thank you once again for another beautiful and healthy day. Thank you for strength and, and, and our minds and grace, mercy, new today. Let this food be nourishing to my beautiful human body and have your way in each and every one of our lives. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen and amen. Okay, y'all. I got these noodles. I got the noodles. So, y'all, uh, you know, at least once a week, I have to have my noodles. The pork was from Sunday's dinner. Y'all remember that? But I'm thinking like, okay, it was good. So let's put some barbecue sauce on it. And I was craving tomatoes, y'all. And I had forgot that I had bought these grape tomatoes. And I got some red onions back there. And then, of course, I have some dressing just to dip my my uh, my tomatoes. So let's um, give y'all the first bite. Y'all ready? It's smoking hot. Might have to blow. But here you go. Yum, yum, give me some. You can have some. Mm -hmm. They just hot right now. Um It's good with that barbecue sauce, ain't it? Uh-huh. You know, I think I have uh, some bread in the refrigerator. I might do a pulled pork sandwich tomorrow. I don't know. No, I'm good. So how y'all doing today? Well, well, let me say this first. You know, Nikki, Nikki, a uh, Davis girlfriend, this is her birthday today. I did, I did have her a, um, a present. But she's gonna have a, a a gathering on Saturday, so uh, I'll be with them on Saturday. They tried to come today to drink. I was like, I, I don't drink on Tuesdays. Mm -mm. I can't drink every day. Mm -mm. My body will beat me up. Mm -mm. I cannot drink every day. I don't even want to drink every day. And sometimes on Wednesdays now, I ain't gonna lie. I may have one cocktail for a hump day. But you know what? Who cares? Because I'm grown, right? I'm a grown woman. Yeah. But I still can't drink every day, y'all. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. You know why I'm on some hot sauce? And then I'll really spicy. I don't care. <laughs> Mm. I don't know, y'all. Just a little bit, but I know I want it on my on my pork. So look, y'all. Today, my squad leader. We have some new people on our team. My squad leader reached out to me so they could shadow me and listen to me do the calls and. Explain to them what I'm doing. 
You know, at first I said, I'm mentally drained. Then I thought about it. I said, okay, I'll do it, you know. What the hell? I'll do it. So I thought I was going to be doing it today, but they was getting all their credentials. And so we thought tomorrow would be better, you know, if it's God's will, of course. Because tomorrow is tomorrow. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. <clears throat> but it's very good, y'all. It is. So, should I? You know what? I got a fork over here. I was like, I don't want to put my fingers in. No. I know that I miss my food. But I wanted it, you know. I really didn't want. I want, I wanted it so bad. Oh y'all! Today I was looking at a one by five five. Well, let me speak them out right now. Mmm. Damn it good. Oh Lord. <clears throat> Gotta stop this. Everything's just hot. But this is the most spicy that I can do. Taking it with Lynn. Go to her page and get her vibe, y'all. Jazzy V, the one who is so amazing in her voice. Mm-hmm. Um, it's Vanjie's world. It's Vanjie's world. Go to her. And eating good. Mm-hmm. She eating good. Mm-hmm. And of course, this hood girl to the hood, I'm eating crazy. <laughs> hey, y'all. So, uh, shout out to my girls. And of course, today, was it today? Yeah, today, Cooking with Judy Carwell did some beef Polish sausage with some grilled um, bell peppers and onions. And then she put some condiments on it, on some uh, sweet, some kind of sweet bond, uh, a hot dog bond. Oh my God. I saved it. Yeah, because I will be doing that. Mm -hmm. I will be doing it. Mm -hmm. It looks so good. Well, bet it out. And Corey is, is doing good as well with that COVID. I talked to her today. Vital signs are, are good and stable. So, you know, this has got to be quarantine for just a, a small, a, another small amount of time. You know, sometimes, you know, we have to be still. You know what I mean? We have to. Sometimes I, I like because I work home from home and I, I was not in the element when the COVID came. And so but even though I had a mild version of it, I, I didn't, you know, I wasn't like deathly ill. But, you know, I do wear my mask now and, you know, I, I'm, you know, kind of, I don't go out to all these crowds and, David is going to be giving Nikki a gathering. So I, I asked him today, who, who going to be there? How many? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because you don't know um, where everybody has been and who they with. Okay? So for me, this little girl, I'll go with... <coughs> That's spicy. I'll go really early and I'll leave before if there's so many people or too many people, I'll leave before they come. With my plate in my hand. A to go plate that is. Mm-hmm. In uh kicking over land bus. Mm-hmm. Even though I said mm -hmm, for a million years, but the way she said, mm -hmm, that's kicking it with land, okay? Look at y'all. So I you know what? 
I'm off on Monday. And it is a scheduled off day. You know, whatever I do this weekend, it's just going to be smooth and, and calm and collective and quiet. Well, I have some music on. So, um, I want to do... Uh, I want to do some of my watermelon hookah on on on, um, on Saturday. Have my cocktail, sit on my patio, and just chill all by myself. Mm -hmm. uh, and y'all, I'm okay with that. You know, being single when you're happy. It's a beautiful thing. And I'm okay with being single. I am so okay. Sometimes, I don't know why this tastes like some fried chicken. I don't know why my taste buds are. Or it's good. Um, sometimes just to sit and be thankful for where you are, and you know, if you can look back over your years and see your growth, you know, it's a beautiful thing. And I'm so, I'm just happy. I'm just, I am really so happy. Yeah. So it's okay, boys and girls, men and women, young and old. It's okay to be single and happy. Just find your happy, you know? Choose your happy. Mm-hmm, mm, uh -huh. mm. Choose it. You know, because we got this one life, y'all. I know I say this a lot of times, but, but it is what it is. We got this one life. Don't regret it. You know, if some of us will be blessed to be old, you know, elders. And when you're sitting on your porch or wherever you at, you don't want to look back over your life and regret anything. Who y'all, I cannot express this enough. Eat the cake, drive the car, live, live and love. And love and live. <laughs> yeah, it took me many years to learn it, but I got it. I don't want to go back. You know, we all have some dark moments. We do. Oh, excuse me. We all have some wilderness. We do. We've been through wilderness. I have. And everything in our life is not always peachy cream either. And that's okay too. Because sometimes you go through shit, it's a lesson. And that's what I said to Dion the other day when we was talking. I said, this New York project, I'm sure that God is trying to teach me something. Because I'm on it too long. So I, have to, I have to back up now and realize, okay, little girl, stop complaining. Learn what you got to learn. Because it's going to be over in a minute. And when the squad leader reached out to me, okay, come on, y'all. Yeah. Pretty good. I'm going to do a real honor. But these red onions, that is good. Barbecue and red onions just go together. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, we can do them. And y'all know how Jazzy B. They eat red onions every single day. And broccoli. <laughs> she eat it every day. I mean, when I say every day, that's so sister love them red onions. Mm-hmm. Y'all didn't see uh, Kicking It With Lynn video today uh, with that hot uh, camera with that Jazzy B uh, challenge. If y'all haven't seen Jazzy B's challenge with the two times uh, spicy camera, go look at it and, and join it. You know, I, I can't do it because I can't. My tummy don't like that hot, hot. I tried it and I was like, ooh, hell no. But um, Kicking It With Lynn's grandchildren, <laughs> They had a 30-second uh, uh, cantaloupe 
challenge. It was so cute. So go look at uh, Kicking, it, uh, Kicking It With Lynn uh, with the camo, y'all. Mm -hmm. And if y'all didn't see it eating good, but that spicy camo, I laughed, y'all. I was sitting here in my living room and I had to laugh out loud. She couldn't get that ice fast enough to, to um, pull off them lips. It was funny. <laughs> it really was funny. It really was. So, eating good. Go look at that one. But you know, the challenge is created by Jazzy V. Okay? And I think, um, I think they all called off somebody. So, um, go to the page if you like that two times spicy. I know a lot of y'all like that two times spicy. Go um, and look at it and then do it. Yeah. Now, I remember me and my husband, as a kid, we lived in the country. We had Delario's. It's a huge uh, farmer's market, a uh, produce market, or whatever you call it, in Hempstead, right? And, you know, Hempstead is famous for watermelons. The watermelon festival is always huge and fun. But when you go to Delario, and get them vine tomatoes right off somebody's garden. My God. Is that fresh and good? Mm. Fresh and good. My mama. My mama tomatoes are fresh and good. Really good. Everything in mother's garden is good, though. Everything. But it was something out of her celery. I ain't like a celery. It was, it was kind of too stringy for me. She asked me, I said, well, mother, it was good, but it was just too stringy. If you eat it raw, that's okay. But when you cook with it, I didn't like it. I didn't like it. So she can keep a celery. Don't tell her I said that here. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I'm telling you, this with the barbecue sauce is kicking. Better than it was with the potatoes I put them here. Look at y'all. I'm go. It feels good. Too. It feels good. It's good to sing myself out, y'all. I mean, I'm gonna spit on y'all, okay? <laughs> Y'all, it's at the end of the video. I am so sorry. I third look. This to all y'all. Salute, salute. Let's sip, 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 sip this good water. We got that water. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I am so sorry. I was hungry, wasn't I? I got one more bottle to drink. And any more after that is a plus, because, you know, I'm trying to drown myself with water for my kidneys, y'all. Okay, y'all. You ready? Let's do this together. It's time to say goodbye for now. We'll have a second chance around on the other side. Whatever you guys do today, do it good. Do it with love. And choose happy, y'all. Life is only for a moment. Be happy. Mm -hmm. If you're not, come see. Come see me. Okay.